Hey everybody, how are we all doing today? Just Sam here from the Men's Channel and today we are going to be looking at five things um, that we learned in the 2022 AFL season. Number one, Craig McRae was the right man for the job. Last year Collingwood finished 17th with 16 losses and only 6 wins. Um, sacking the long-time coach Nathan Buckley and getting in Craig McRae, which was a bit different. This year they've finished fourth on the ladder and are currently in the prelim and it's a truly a big change of events for the Collingwood Football Club. Um, and they're in a good space at the moment with lots of young players um, and everything seems happy at the moment for Collingwood. So, um, yeah, all going well. Number two, Geelong is still on top. Geelong has yet again had another great year, but this year um, they have the oldest team in the comp. But the form in the latter place proves maybe age doesn't matter that bad. But being on top for 15 years, how long can they go for? You know, they've been in top for so long. How long can they actually go for without, you know? Oh my God, what are you doing? My cat's like... You all right? All right, we're just going to keep them going. Um, but yeah, how long can they go for? Number three. Another disappointing year for Carlton. One of the all-time chokes sealed out Carlton out for the finals once again. But with such a star team, how long will it take for the Blue Blaggers to get into the finals? How long is it going to take? How long is it going to take for them to win a premiership? It's been quite a while and they've got a really good young team. So, um, yeah, it has to be soon. North Melbourne be are below rock bottom. I don't think you can get... Any worse for North Melbourne, as now they're the number one draft pick, doesn't even want to play for them, Jason or Francis. Um, but at least this year they'll get another number one draft pick. Um, and they also have a new coach in Alistair Clarkson, which I'm really excited about um, as, a, as a Hawthorne fan. But um, yeah, it's a bit sad. Number five, the last one, R. Richmond Dumb. Is this the end of Richmond? Is this the end of the Richmond dynasty? Three premierships over four years and the threat of losing their three-time Norm Smith medalist Dustin Martin. But who do you guys think is going to be the next dynasty? Comment down below. Will it be Melbourne? Will it be Collingwood? Will it be Geelong? Um, comment down below and that's going to be the end of the video for today. So, um, yeah, thanks everyone for watching and, um, yeah, we'll see you later.